Yeah, there we go. <laughs> okay. Game capture. Specific windows. Trombone jump. <laughs> Is it capturing it? Yay! <laughs> okay, you guys. <clears throat> this was just me testing stuff out. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I'm so excited. <sighs> Oh, I'll be fine. so it comes to pass. Ages after the twin vessels were forged, a new soul appears. Brave soul, one day you will stand before two baboons. One day you will rend the very fabric that binds this land. But until that day comes, you must toot. Toot your trombone, brave soul, and you may yet become the trombone champ. <laughs> oh my god, it just starts off so freaking goofy. And I love it. I'm here for it. Welcome to Trombone Champ. Choose play to play the main game. Afterwards, many secrets await thee. Okay, so play. What's the difference between jubilant and astutious? Honestly, different. I'm gonna guess that's the difficulty. I don't know. All right. Oh, I can't change the looks either. I'm just stuck with this pre-made. Wait, why is he running? Oh, he's not running anymore. Okay. Yeah, this one's running. Trixie Bell. Meldor. Ger Majesty. Ger Majesty. I actually kind of like that. Horn Lord. Soda? That's your name, Soda? I can't rename any of you. Appaloosa. Beezerly! Oh, I might have to go with that because of the name. Kaisley? That's kind of a cute name. Alright, I think. <sighs> Beezerly or Your Majesty. But Beezerly kind of looks. Like, Ma Your Majesty looks much more presentable. I'm just gonna go with that one. Okay. Alright. A world of music awaits you, but first let's start with a warm-up. Now, when I told you guys that I have tested this out, I have checked stuff out. So, using my, my lovely mouse here, I don't know if y'all can see it, uh, the controls are inverted. So pretty much, well, I'll, I'll just show you. Warm up your trombone with a simple warm-up perfect for first timers. Tears! <gasps> Tears! Okay. Move the mouse forward and back to move the slide. You can adjust the controls in the setting menu. <gasps> I can? Oh, wait, if I can, use the mouse button or most keyboard keys to toot. To toot! <laughs> Alright, um, using the keyboard may be easier on your wrists. Yeah, maybe. If you play well, you build combos and increase your champ meter. CHAMP! <laughs> this is how you get big points. Watch the breath meter. If you hold a note for too long, you run out of breath. Alright. Most of all, have fun and enjoy the beautiful, succulent music you will, be, you will soon create. Let me see if I can just immediately click on the settings. Because if I can make it... Escape. Escape. No, I can't. Um, extra. Okay. I'm gonna do that and see if I can change the settings real quick. Cause y'all don't understand how freaking hard it is to play uh, with inverted controls audio. Baboon quality quantity. Um, gameplay controls edit controls default math inverted up and down not inverted. See, it's automatically on inverted. Gosh, save and apply. Okay, back. That's gonna help me out so much. Now, listen. 
my father, he he plays with his um, up and down buttons, to look up and look down. He plays with that inverted, and I've adjusted to it, so I can switch on the fly from inverted to normal, but it, why is it more now? But it's, um... It's different on mouse. I'm used to that on controller. I'm not used to that on the mouse. Okay, now we're genuinely gonna give this a shot. It's gonna be bad. It's gonna be bad. You guys are gonna have to prepare for this. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> so it starts. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, Lord, help me. I'm a champ. How do I use a champ meter? Oh, I don't. That's right. It's just supposed to be a bigger point. No, I actually clicked and held it. <laughs> God, help. <laughs> I almost hit it. <laughs> okay, what did I get? I got an A. I earned 282 toots. I'm the toot master. <laughs> cards? What are cards? We're just gonna learn everything together. Welcome to your collection. Play the main game to earn toots and then spend them on tromboner cards. You can, can you collect all 50? Turds! Give me a sec. Okay, I don't have enough. Okay, but oh, but oh. please don't tell me. Fuck. Okay, let's take a play of this now. Okay. Um. This has become the theme song of North American baseball. Although neither of the song's authors had attended a game, a game at the time of its writing. Interesting. Okay, this is a staple for America. There are between two and four spiders living inside the average trombone. I'd actually believe that. <laughs> Honestly? <laughs> Honestly, I'm doing decent. You guys recognize it? Yeah. Yeah. Why is it clicking and holding? How did I do? Aw, oh, almost as. 300 toots! I have enough for a card pack. <laughs> Give me my toots. Give me a sack. Are you sure you want to spend 499 toots to purchase? Yes! Give me the toots! Click the sack. Okay, before I do this, I need a drink of my tea. Mmm. Actually. I'll be back. Yeah, because I'm already making a mess. This glass is weird. Um, it spills. So one second.
We are good now. <laughs> this chair doesn't want to move. <sighs> All right. Four fresh, unique tromboner cards. Do not eat. I won't eat. Don't worry. Oh. All base clef notes. Oh, wait. No, there's also triple clef. Okay. This looks cool. Okay. Trombone. Without the trombone, none of us would be here. It is the glue that binds us together and the force that keeps us moving forwards. Often called the baboon of instruments, it is the alpha and the omega. Immutable. It's pretty. G W C W Gluck. Gluck was one of the first to introduce trombone into ballet and opera beginning in Don Juan. Don Juan, sorry. Um... This may have in later influenced Mozart to use his, the trombone in his compositions. He could eat 30 hot dogs in one sitting. I don't know how much I, how much I trust these facts. Gustav Mahler. I mean, I'm not no music expert, okay? I played the trombone. I used to play the trombone in high school and in middle school. I, I know it. I played it for a while. But uh, that doesn't mean that this is accurate. <laughs> Gustav Mahler, this Australian-born composer, was one of the leading condu conductors of his time due to, the Jewish due to his Jewish ancestry. His compositions were banned throughout much of Europe due to during the Nazi era, but they later, arc uh, they later achieved wide popularity. Okay, and trumpet, the coward's trombone. Okay. Oh, wait a second. Oh, wait. You see how this has, like, a diamond? That has granite. I don't even know what gem. The oh, a jet? I think that maybe it might be a jet. And then, like, this has... I'm going to guess that's the Austrian flag. And I'm going to guess that this was... I'm bad with flags. I want to say that's the German flag, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to click continue. <laughs> Advanced info. Baboon. Okay, we're going to play a little bit more. We're going to see what all we can get accomplished. All right, next is Old Gray Mare. Written by the seven-time mayor of Baltimore, Maryland. Some believe this song is about the horse, Lady Suffolk. I can see it. I can see it. <clears throat> the first trombone was invented in 20 million BC. Oh! God, this is hard. Champ! I lost it. I shouldn't have said anything. I'm a loser now. Oh, that's how it ends? <laughs> Man, this is this sucks because I could see this close to getting an A. But I can see where um what, like, the backgrounds and everything. And I want to watch the backgrounds, but I can't because I have to focus. This is hard. For anybody who's never played the trombone, I want you to know that this is not accurate at all. If, you know, just just if you didn't already know that. Okay, not saying you didn't. Just... Ooh, random. Let's do random. What's it going to give us? Zara, Zara Thusta. The first part of this piece, titled Sunrise, became famous after being used in the film 2001, A Space Odyssey. <sighs> Difficult 
51? Is it trying to say something? Oh. oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Okay, we're good. We're good. Oh, we're not good. Oh, okay, now I know what I'm playing. Perfecto! I don't think so. I think that was pretty shit. Okay, what's baboon? What's baboon? Tell me what the baboon is. Alright, I guess I'm just not worthy of being a baboon yet. Okay, mm, I don't know. Anyway, let's. Oh, I actually backed out. Fine. Random. Yay. Rosa Monday. Oh, that's difficult. Oh, tears, slides, and doots. That's what to expect. No spunk. <laughs> I don't know what all these information, like what, what all this means. I know that doots are. From what I know of, it's a jazz-like term. There are more trombones on Earth than there are humans. I do not believe that either. Oh. <laughs> Man, this is hard. I was a champ for a moment in my life. This is hard. God, my mouse keeps getting away from me. God, this is hard. <laughs> this is so hard. It's great though. I'm loving it. But it's... 325 toots. Okay, now I'm gonna go buy a card. Hello, I didn't know you were alive. It's okay, Cricket. Hello. It's great to have you. Thank you for stopping by. Cricket, I'm buying, I'm buying some cards with my toots. <gasps> I can buy two sacks. Alright, I'm doing it. Click the sack. Welcome, this is Trombone Champ. Um, <laughs> it's, it's fun, it's goofy, I love it, and it's hard. All 
All right. Let's see what cards I got. Design your own. This trombone card is intentionally left blank, so you can design your own. Oh, I love that. Roswell Rudd. That sounds so familiar. Legendary tromboner and composer who worked in free and avant-garde jazz, taught enthusiasm and ethnomusicology, performed in Malian and Mongolian musicians with, sorry, not in, with, <laughs> and could eat 900 hot dogs per nanosecond. Now I'm starting to feel like that's not accurate. Oh, hello, Leech. Um, so Panda's not here with us today. Uh, she said that t normally today is her early day, but she did have to work later today. Uh, and I do feel bad. She, she was really looking forward to it, but... We're here, and I got new games to show you guys. I got this game. I have um, House Flipper with all the DLC. I've also got, um, we could play Traveler's Rest if we wanted. And there was one other that I got. Oh, Getting Over It. I'm excited to play that one, too. All right, Mel Melba Liston. This Missouri-born, Missouri, the Missouri-born jazz trombonist and composer was the first woman trombonist to play in big bands during the 1940s and later worked on arrangements for Mo Motown Records. She could eat 10,000 hot dogs in one sitting. Again, that's a stretch. Just a little bit. Treble clef, favorite clef of the primordial baboon tote seeker Tom. This clef represents light, but there can be no light without dark. You know, I feel like that's a very good representation of treble clef versus bass clef. I feel like bass clef is more darker than treble clef. Music! <laughs> Music is what we call the sounds made by trombones. It's like hot dogs for your ears. What is up with this game in hot dogs? It sounds really good, except for when it sounds bad. Try to find music that you enjoy and then listen to it a lot. Okay. Mozart Music Storm. The Austrian mage holds the key to the ear wing of Tempo Keep. He will light you up with the sound of his sweet keys. News. Bobby. Bobby. This ancient Egyptian defecation... De defecate... Yeah, defecation of the Hamadri's... Hamadria's baboon, whose name translates to the bull of the baboons, or chief of the baboons, was a deity of the underworld and is very rel deity of the underworld, <laughs> and is very relevant to this trombone game. I'm yeah, I'm sure. Oh, okay, got a second trouble clef. Cool. Okay, no more sacks, no more cards. Let's play again. Look at it, Beezerly. I'm choosing between Beezerly and Your Majesty, but I think I'm gonna stick with Beezerly. All right, random. I've already done old gray mare. I'm not doing it again. Can't force me. Danny boy. Oh, much fury. Look at all the fury. <laughs> this timeless Irish ballad set to the tune of London Barry Air is it typically played at full volume on a trombone. Time to change that. All right, wish me luck, guys. This is hard. The highest note playable on a trombone is so high pitched, I couldn't read the rest because it was too fast. This is so slow to compare to everything else that I've played. <laughs>
Yeah, the other ones that I played earlier, which you guys can go ahead and check out after the stream's done and everything, um, they were much faster than this. Oh my god, that was rough. <laughs> it wasn't even terrible. It was just kind of a downer. Alright, no, we're doing a new one. Hi, Wolf. Good to have you. Thanks for coming. Blue the newbie. I'm gonna have more slides and spunk and fury. <laughs> no dudes. I have no dudes. Okay. Thank you for wishing me luck. It was the world record. God, it goes by so fast. I don't even have time to read. Oh, no. Oh, it's this. <laughs> Help. That was cute. I wish that I could be able to see the background too. Okay, I'm gonna buy some cards. I don't know. Should I keep playing this or should I go try getting over it? Yes, give me a sack. Sack with my toots. I have no idea what the turds are. We don't, we don't have to know. JS Bach. Johann Sebastian Bach is widely considered one of the most influential composers of all time. <gasps> Partially due to his Baroque, uh, Baroque compositions, but mostly because he invented the hot dog. I don't trust this. <laughs> Glenn Miller, this trombonist and ba band leader, extremely popular in the early 1940s, died while flying to France to Eastern U U.S. troops during World War II. His aircraft disappeared over the English Channel during bad weather. Oh, that's sad. Alright, trombone, I've read that one before, and the bobby, I just read that one. Alright, what are you guys feeling? Actually, I can... Here we go. Start a poll! Oh my god, I can't spell! <laughs> what should I play? Oh! Getting over it. Oh, God. Found a champ. Started. Ooh. Uh, oh, okay, I guess it's a, that's old and I can do that. So then I'll do 
That, and then what was the other one that I had? God, why do I always forget it? It's so forgettable. Trombone chain as well, guys. Man, I had one more. I thought. Yes. Okay. There you guys go. Enjoy the pool. Have fun. <laughs> In the meantime, I'll do this one more time. <laughs> oh, no, I can't see this. No, I don't care about it. Close the pool. Okay. Alright, let's just do for giggles. William Tell Overture. Originally, it's overture for an opera. The overture for an opera. This piece has been widely used and widely parodied over time. Let's struggle a little bit, hmm? It takes over 3,000 tons of brass to produce a thing. That's a lie. I. You think that thing takes 3,000 tons? There's people in the background. Oh my god, this is hard. Oh lord. <laughs> it's hard because my mouse pad's not that huge. This is easy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so focused right now, y'all don't even understand. Oh, that's the whole thing? Okay, y'all. Actually, for that being a really high difficulty, I feel like that wasn't too hard. That, that wasn't too hard. Ooh, 300 toots. 300 toots. 300 toots. Do -do -do. I need to click this again, actually. And do 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 do. Ooh, 100% says get it.